Let's say, hypothetically, you love getting splats in Splatoon. Hypothetically, playing objective might not be your thing. Maybe you have an insatiable bloodlust that can only be satisfied by long range kills while also covering insane amounts of turf. In the early days of Splatoon, there was no way to truly satisfy these needs. Then we were graced with the Nautilus. Imagine the powerful force and range of a splatling mixed with the mobility of a splatter shot and throw in enough painting power to kill a seahorse. You've got yourself a Nautilus. I know what you're thinking. There's no way this weapon is that good in every field. And you'd be right, this weapon is excellent for getting splats. It's borderline unethical, but it does take some time to charge up, which can leave you vulnerable in a lot of scenarios. Don't worry though, there is a solution. All you need to do is charge up your knot when nobody's looking, avoid player contact like an introvert at a house party, and then when they have their backs turned, unleash the firepower. The best part about this weapon is its ability to cover turf, especially a splat zone. Maybe you're like me and you like being annoying, in which case the Nautilus will have you covered, or rather it has your enemies covered because you can make sure they can't get past you when you have the entire map painted. Now lately, everybody's been pointing out how in Splatoon 3, the Nauts kit got nerfed with Inkstorm as a special and Point Sensor as a sub. And I understand why some people are upset. However, I still believe in this weapon. Unless the enemy team has a VPN, you can track onto your enemies and never lose sight of them. And with Inkstorm, you basically double your inking power as if you didn't already have enough. But let's not ignore the best feature of the Nautilus, the ability to recharge ink while shooting a burst. And even better, the ability to hold a charge when hiding an ink. There's nothing more terrifying or irritating than an actual killer splatling popping up in front of you with a full charge. The moment you see a knot in front of you, your coffin is already being built. Just remember to not get too carried away with getting splats. This power must be handled responsibly, otherwise you'll die like an idiot. Your job is to help your team at the end of the day. Behind every unbeatable team is an even more unbeatable Nautilus player. So get out there and stay alive, otherwise it will be for naught. <laughs> get it, not like for naught. Pun about the Nautilus.